Who would win? Lobster versus crab. What if a lobster and a crab bumped in into each other? What if they had a fight? Who do you think would win? Which lobster should fight the crab? Spiny lobster from the Caribbean? Sorry, you are no you are spiky, but have no claws. Pink spotted prawn? No way, you are a shrimp, not a lobster. Shovel nosed lobster? Nope. You are you are strange looking. Go dig up a clam. An American lobster? Perfect. Two claws. Which crab should fight the lobster? Dungeness crab? No. It is famous in San Francisco. And on the west coast, its shell is rubbery. Alas Alaskan king crab? No. You have only six legs. You are popular in restaurants all over the world. Horseshoe crab? No, you are not even a crab. You look prehistoric. Blue crab? Yes, you are the one. You are one of the best known crabs in the world. And maybe and maybe the best tasting. The American lobster scientific name is Homarus Americanus. It lives off America's northeast and Canada's east east coasts. The largest lobster was about three feet long and weighed 44 pounds. This is a blue crab. It is the most popular crab in the world. Its scientific name is Calanectus sapidus, which means beautiful, savory swimmer. The largest blue crab was about one foot wide and weighed a little more than one pound. American lobsters live from North Carolina's coastline up to Canada's east coast. Lobsters can be found in shallow water, in shallow water close to shore, and also in deep water miles out. Range of the American lobster. Blue crabs are most often found from the south shore Cape Cod in Massachusetts. All the way down to the Texas-Mexico border, Chesapeake, Chesapeake Bay is one of the most famous places for blue crabs. Range of the blue crab in the U.S. The lobster's head and thorax is one piece. It's called cephalo. It's it's called a cephalothorax. A lobster has eight legs, just like a spider and, and a scorpion. On land, lobsters cannot walk well. The front, two, the front two legs on each side have pinchers on them. The blue crab's body is one piece. Its shell is called a carapace. Blue crabs can swim well, and they are also great runners. They can run fast on land. The crusher claw of a male lobster is bigger and wider than a female crusher claw. The flaps under the tail are called sw swimmerets. You can tell a male lobster by the hard shell on the top swimmeret. Female lobsters have a smaller string-like top swimmeret. Female lobsters Female lobster tails are wider than male lobster tails. Crabs have a flap between their eight legs. That is called an apron or a leaf. The girl's leaf is shaped like the like the capital dome. Girl blue crabs also have red tips on their claws. They look like painted fingernails. Boy blue crabs have a skinny leaf. Some some say it is shaped like the Washington Monument.
The two claws of a lobster are different. The crusher claw is dull, and the scissor claw is sharp. The crusher claw is lower and stronger, and usually wider. The scissor claw is quicker and skinnier. Either claw could be on the right or the left. Can you call them claws or pinchers? Both words are correct. Most lobsters are caught by traps. Traps are baited with fish heads and guts and fish bones. A, a buoy is a marker that floats on top of the water. Lobster men can tell their gear by the colors of the buoy. Blue crabs are caught by crab pots. Trot lines Crab pots, trot lines, and by a dip net. Crabs love fish bait. Chicken, fish, steak, or any meat works works well. Lobsters have an exoskeleton, which is a hard shell on the outside of their bodies. To grow larger, lobsters have to climb up out of their shells and grow and then grow a larger shell. This is called molting. Crabs also have an exoskeleton and molt to grow larger. A female lobster with eggs is called an egger or a cedar. She carries the eggs with a with which are dark green under her tail attached to her body and swimmerettes. The eggs turn light orange and hatch. The mom lobster carries between 3,000 and 75,000 eggs. A sponger is a female crab with eggs. A crab is a crab. The crab below is a female blue crab who, whose leaf is full of eggs. Scientists think there are up to 2 million eggs in a large blue crab. Lobsters can't see well. They have, they have an antenna that, see, that sends vibrations in the water. They have a great sense of smell. Crabs can't see well. They have a great sense of smell and their an antenna can see motion. Lobsters have spikes all over the shells. They are armored and ready for battle. Spikes on the nose, spikes on the tail, spikes on the knuckles. Measure from the eye socket to the end of its head. In most, in most states, the head must be three and a half inches long to be a keeper. A crab has sharp points around its body. Take a good look at the blue crab. Predators can't easily swallow it. Measure a crab from point to point, from point to point, from side to side, from side to side. In most states, a crab must be at least five inches long to be a keeper. Someone once said, everything tastes like chicken, but nothing tastes as good as lobster. What it, what's this boiling water for? I think it's for cooking corn. Other people say the blue other people say blue crab is the greatest food on earth. It's okay to be in a bad mood some of the time. You're a crab. The lobster wants to be left alone. It climbs into a crevice. Into a crevice. The crab wants to be left alone, too. It burrows into some mud. They both get hungry. The crab walks around, looking for food. It stumbles upon the lobster. The crab tries to take a bite. Whoosh! The lobster flaps its tail and gets away. The crab runs after it. Whoosh! Another flap of, of its tail. And the lobster gets away. But the lobster is hungry. 
it walks claws it walks claws first at the crab the crab flap flaps its paddle shaped legs and swim over and swims over to the lobster the lobster is patient when the crab gets close the lobster attacks the lobster's quick scissor claw grabs the crab by one crab by one of its claws the lobster crusher claw swings over and crack the lobster damages the crab's claw damages the crab's claw the lobster gets a couple of legs now the crab can't run away the lobster and the crab fight back and forth the crab's claws are not strong enough to hurt the lobster the lobster moves its moves its crusher claw and bites a chunk of the crab's face the crab fills with water from the hole the hole in its shell this is fatal the crab slowly stops moving the lobster agrees agrees with people crabs are delicious author note this is one way the fight may have ended how would you write the ending